Etna erupts again, two months after its last eruption. Despite the shocking images, the volcanic quakes are, quote, at a consistently high level, and there is no concern that the situation could get out of control. Early Wednesday, Etna's southeastern crater entered a new eruptive phase with explosions, lava flows, and clouds of gas and ash. The volcano erupted at an altitude of 1,500 feet, 5,000 meters, rising to 1,000 feet, 2,500 meters, above the vent at the top of the crater. Despite the shocking images shared since the eruption, as of around 3.30 a.m., the volcanic quakes were currently at a high level. The volcanic cloud at an altitude of 5,000 meters, 16,000 feet, and winds blowing to the southwest suggest it will not affect local activity or operations at Catania's Vincenzo Bellini International Airport, the closest airport to southern Sicily. At around 2 a.m., an earthquake was recorded before the crater erupted three-quarters of an hour later. The volcano's reactivation comes just two months after its last eruption, which occurred on February 12th. Back then, the violent volcanic activity that lasted for days and left a three-kilometer-long lava flow behind forced the closure of air traffic in Catania. INGV has issued a code red warning to aircraft flying around the site. The ash cloud has caused significant flight disruptions at Catania Fontana Rosa Airport. Airport authorities have announced a reduction in the number of incoming flights to six per hour and the partial closure of airport facilities.
Due to the ongoing volcanic activity, operations at Catania Fontana Rosa Airport have been severely affected. Officials have reported that flight arrivals will be restricted and parts of the airport will be temporarily closed to ensure passenger safety. Mount Etna has been showing frequent volcanic activity since early July, following a period of dormancy following a major eruption in December 2023. Last December's event saw the volcano erupt heavily with ash and lava, and since then, its activity has been relatively quiet until it re-emerged this summer.